Alright, as this foxy reptile invites me to golf in, Sergeant Dotmetic invites me to slow and low. Are you looking for a fast way to make lots of money? Because if you are, then I have the method for you. So, I've spent I've been spending the past like 11 hours doing heists today. And I went from about 500,000 to 110,000, so I made about 600,000 in 11 hours. But I just now made like what was it? $43,000 in less than 20 minutes. And I can make more too. Alright, so what you want what you need to do to do this is have at least one million dollars in your bank. You can do that if you're on PC by clicking Z. And if you have over one million dollars, or another way is push up on the D-pad, go to internet, and you run to money and services. You go to Maze Bank and you check here. So I have one million one hundred and three thousand four hundred thirty-one dollars. So I have more than a million. So then what you want to do is you want to open the interaction menu. Which if you're on PC, then <coughs> you press M. Now you want to go to Securo Serve VIP, and you want to do like, yeah, 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 yeah. I want to be a VIP organization, and you want to make your own. And then once you make it. You just want to go to VIP work. Sightseer is really easy. Uh, yeah, I'll be able to do that. Hang on one second. All right, now you want to start Sightseer, and you want to click start. Now, it'll pop up like this. You just want to hit your phone and go to Sightseer, and you want to do whichever one is up. So for me, the first one now is find the IP, which is right here, and then it'll give you a location on your map that you have to drive as quickly as possible to get do this do these definitely in an invite only session otherwise you're racing other people to get these packages as well so they'll have to hack in find the location themselves and then go to the locations too so that's another thing they'll have to hack in so if you're a faster hacker and you have a faster car you might be able to be someone next to you but what if someone drew it close Say, I believe that everybody has the exact same locations on the three. So, just go into an invite only session. It's not that hard. And then start the VIP map work. So, I forgot to drive up here, and I think I'm going near the docks. Like the dock warehouses, maybe? Yeah, that seems where it's located. So, I'll slow back down once I get there. I know I'm not right there, but I'm basically there, so I just slowed it down. And I feel like I'd sound a bit different if I do this from any of my other videos. I don't really know what's going on with my throat, but it was making me talk like this, like really weird. <coughs> when I can still talk normal like this. My friends tell me I talk in a monotone voice. Alright, so you'll see a green arrow. You want to just grab that and then keep going. Oops. So you want to open up sites here again and for this one, I have this one now. And you just want to press enter every time that the red letter goes into the blue bar. And we're done. Alright, so this one's closer too. My first one last time had like a 10k uh, trip and then like a 8k and then like a 5k trip. So it was a lot closer to the time ending. So I think this one will be a lot quicker. But as long as this takes 5 minutes more. Be good. So, I'll explain how the VIP stuff works. They're all on a timer, so once you complete one objective, like one of the VIP work, you have to wait a certain amount of time based on which one it is before you can run it again. 
So by just rotating through all of them over and over again in a specific order, I believe that you can actually cut down the wait time to about one minute after completing all the availables. So we open sights here again, and this one, when the two white boxes go and the space in between is at the red, you want to hit enter. Oops. No. No. Oh my gosh. It's like lock picking. Oh my gosh, I suck at this one. Finally. Alright, so see how what I mean at this now is now a 3.4k trip. Alright, so now we get to the third package. We pick it up, and BAM! Oh. 22,500. Huh. Last time he gave me 25,000. Alright, whatever. So, once this goes off the screen, I'm gonna hit. Go back, and... Alright, so now you just want to do like a quick little mission and then you get that one again. You can do that stuff. So yeah, it's really easy stuff, like I'm not kidding, it's really easy. You saw how easily I went to those three locations and grabbed those cases and got like $22,500, so that's literally by far the best money making I've found so far, other than doing a heist really quickly with a good group of people so hope this helped you and I'll see you in the next video bye guys so I just wanted to repeat one thing before I ended out this video once you do one of the VIP works then you just want to go into a really quick mission that takes like 10 minutes at most and once you complete that, then you'll be good to go with another one of the VIP missions. So you can just rinse and repeat over and over again. Be a hostile takeover at the Fort Zancudo if you're right next to it is really easy. The one I've had only. I've only done it once so far. Was I had to go in with my... What's it called? My Karuma. Get in a tank and drive like 4K. Four kilometers. It wasn't hard. It was really easy. It took me like five minutes and it gave me seventeen thousand dollars. I think maybe the more time you spend on the VIP missions as well gives you more money. I will be doing more testing and I will leave a comment down below this video if that is the truth. If spending more time in the VIP missions nets you more overall money at the end, then I will tell you exactly how long you should wait and if you should wait for like the last minute. But that's it for this video, and I'll talk to you next time. Bye, guys!